Hi, my beautiful Taurus. Welcome to my channel. My name is Natasha, Goddess of Life 1111. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are returning subscribers, welcome back. This reading is for my lovely Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Thank you, God. Thank you, Universe, Universal Energy, my sister, my spirit, God, the pure white light. Archangel Michael, Ascended Masters, please give my lovely, beautiful Torian a clear, precise, honest message. Thank you, thank you. This is a general love reading. I won't resonate with everyone. If this reading is not resonate with you, please check out your other birth chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonate and leave the rest. Okay, my Taurus, I love you guys so much. I appreciate all of your help, your support. And please, we are not going to win the cards on the floor. I appreciate it. Awaiting results. So some of you could be waiting on some money. Are you patiently waiting for someone to make a decision here? That's what I'm feeling. Oh, look at this fire. Hold on now. Wait a minute. Now, there you go. It's that sexiness right there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Energies are flowing. If this reading is not for you, it's not for you. All right, Taurus, let's get this show on the road. I appreciate all of your help, your supports, your subscribes. I am so, 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 so grateful for you guys. Okay, let's see what's going on for my Taurian. Sorry, guys, but <laughs> I have to let this burn. Oh, uh-huh. So some of you have to let something burn. Let it, you know, go with the flow. Let it burn by itself. Simply love is at the bottom. So for some of you, you could have, you know, a water side or uh, you could have water on your chart. But what I'm feeling here is that someone is trying to make a decision. You know, it's either you thinking about the past or the past is thinking about you. May I please have two cards, please, for Taurus? Okay. The magician. So you guys are manifesting. Beautiful. You're coming as the magician here. Guys, all the tools. You're manifesting something brand new. One more card for Taurus, please. Oh, this card just flew on my laps. Okay. Just breathe. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Don't do anything. Pretty much that's what this card's telling me. You know, go to a to spiritual retreat, you know, spiritual include, do some, you know, healing and stuff like that. Don't do nothing. The magician here, what I'm feeling is that you can manifest whatever you want. You have all the tools and stuff like that. You don't have to do nothing. What they say? Let it burn. Mm, okay. May I please have two cards for this person Taurus is dealing with? May I please have two cards, please, for this person Taurus is dealing with? Oh, well. Okay. <laughs> All right, Taurus, so this is you. You could be doing, dealing with another Taurus like yourself, or you could be dealing with in... Um, the magician here. Blossoming. So someone here, my Taurus, they want a new beginning. Yes, they are. Someone is, I feel like someone is definitely, you know, this is a lot of spiritual, a lot of spiritual growth here. When I see the, you know, some of you could be dealing with, with you know an institution um a lot of a group group activities i don't know some of you got there's some group activity going on here um you know some of you could be dealing with a judge or a lawyer here but i feel like you know you could be dealing with in tourists like yourself or there's also a Scorpio you could be dealing with, but I feel like you are manifesting. Someone in here need to he means the uh, you know some past uh, things, past life relationship could be that also believe and succeed. Some past life relationship or some childhood um, relationship that's need to be uh, dealt with in order for to move forward here. That's what I'm feeling here for my toes. 
a lot of distraction, Taurus. You deserve love. Yeah, someone is manifesting something new. There's deception. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking. Fate will bring you warm. And so what I'm feeling here for some of you, you know, see what I'm saying? Reconciliations. Okay, so someone, that's what I'm feeling like here for you, Taurus, and stuff like that. You, you, you know, someone here want a reconciliation with you. That's what I was feeling that, you know, when I see, you know, the manifesting. You want to manifest something new, but someone want a reconciliation with you. Stay optimistic about, you know, your love life. And, and it is someone from your past, but... You know, someone in here could be wearing a first mask. Someone in here could be, you know, they want that reconciliation, but they don't know how you're going to think. They don't know what you're thinking, how you feel about reconcile with them and stuff like that. Because I feel like if you are healings, if you are healings and stuff like that, things then end up why someone in here could be married or marriage or the situation could be if you give it this you know, a chance and stuff like that, it could end up into a uh, higher commitment or marriage. But what I'm feeling here is like, you don't trust this person. Mm -hmm. I feel like you don't trust someone here or someone don't just trust you, but I feel like definitely, you know, this situation is calling for you to have faith because I feel like someone has stabbed you in the back before. <clears throat> you feel like someone, you know, Put a dagger on your, you know, they betray you before. May I please have three cards for Taurus, please? May I please have three cards, spirit, for for Taurus? But they want to work conciliation with you. You know, usually people do that. And at this time, there will be a lot of people that go deal with karmic and stuff like that. You know what they say? Everything, um, everything that's glowing is, then, you know, if it, and doesn't it's not glitter everything that's gold isn't glitter whatever you don't know what i'm trying to say but the devil yeah you could be dealing with you know a capricorn or you could be dealing with someone that's you know really obsessive toxicity you know that's you know with the deception here and stuff like that so you know this is someone that could have a lot of addictive personality one more cards for Taurus. yeah you could be dealing with an aquarius capricorn here Two cards for this person. Two cards. A new beginning. Yeah. Someone definitely wants a brand new beginning. This is the Ace of Wands. They want a brand new beginning with you. They want that with reconciliation. May I have two other two more cards, please? Thank you. Well, I guess two will do. Yeah. Ten of Cups, but the Tower, like I say, you could be dealing with a Scorpio or in Aries here, but, okay, so, this person want a reconciliation with you, they want to have a happy life, happy wife, you know, they want a long-term stability, long-term commitment with you, this person having a hard moment, this is like, you know, to, the Ten of Cups and the Tower, what I'm feeling in here, this is someone that realized that, oh my God, someone in just have a Tower moment. The universe is just showing this person. You do realize that Taurus is your person. You do realize that there is no one like Taurus. You do realize that no one compared to Taurus. So this person is having a aha moment. They are having a Tower moment while they walk away. You see that what I'm saying? They have, an, they have an awakening straight to because you can see that, you know, if there's two people, one person is already down. And then the other person realizes that, wow, I just F everything up. So they have an aha moment by having a tower moment. Because whomever, like I say, whomever you are dealing with, this person could be a bit toxic. They could be... um what they could be uh, all about themselves. You could be dealing with someone and stuff like that. You know, they are trying to heal the, they are trying to heal the toxic way with the star and the devil. What I'm feeling here is that someone could be like, um, the addiction is they like to be, they like attention. 
that's the addiction and stuff like that they like people you know they like admire they like attention seeker that's what i'm feeling here someone who's really like about in the spotlight but they like they're not uh they don't like it they love it <laughs> they're like attention seeker <laughs> can i find the awakening please yeah the nine of wands Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Someone is like, you know what? I've done this before and I'm turning my back on it and I'm walking away. That's what I'm feeling in here with this, the night of one and stuff like that. Yeah, you see, this person is like looking at <clears throat> making sure that, you know, what's behind them is well guarded, well protected and stuff like that. They are, you know, stand with that one and stuff like that anyone that's coming i'm ready to defend my honor i'm ready to defend myself i'm ready to defend what belongs to me that's what i'm feeling here look at that the six of cups beautiful six of cups here can i find the six of cups yeah someone from your past yeah oh yes the we've swords in the reverse someone from your past is coming towards you because they're here but like i said this is someone that like attention they like they like a lot of people around them, attention seeker, attention grabber. You know, they could be, you know, they could be someone and stuff like that. If there was not, you know, and it's become toxic because all the people they have around them is toxic. They are their star on their own right, but by having toxic people around. Is that, you know, if you all know what I mean. The devil, prefer the devil card, please. Wheel of Fortune. So, someone could have, you know, try to move on, to move forward from this energy. Could be, yeah, that's what I'm saying. They try to heal from it. They try to move forward from it. You know, someone could be dealing with the Cancerian heat, the Temperance. Yeah, Sagittarius energy. So, it's like, you know, someone is trying to balance out the energy. I feel like the angel is coming around to tell this person, you're going to have to, you know, you're going to have to balance, be, you know, balance this. Someone is contemplating and stuff like that, moving forward to healing, to balance out the energy. Two of swords, because there's something they are not see clearly. Someone feel black and someone could try to make a decision and stuff. Between more than one. So if I did two of swords, see what I'm saying? I told you someone have a decision to make between more than one. This is having making a decision here. Like toxic. Someone got a lot of toxic people around them. Clarify this star. Ah, see, I told you. Like, it's like someone doesn't like to be alone. They don't know how to be alone. Three of Pentacles, feeling left out, you know. Five of Pentacles, feeling left out in the cold here. Three of Pentacles, tell me, is that someone could also, you know, struggling with, you know, finance and stuff, struggling to work together. So they feel, you know, this is someone who's having money. They could have money issues here. Page of Cups. They're addicted to fame. They're addicted to, uh, you know, they're addicted to attention. I don't know what you call it. Attention seeker, attention grabber. You know, this is someone that's addictive to having, you know, a lot of people around. I mean, Page of Cups, there's some type of message, apology this person wants to bring to you. Yeah, because whatever this message and stuff like that, you're going to reject them. You're not going to work. We don't want to work with them because the eight of pentacles is in the reverse. So again, you know, whatever this is for someone in here is going to be disappointing because this is, you know, I feel like you're like, no, I'm not doing this. For again, because there's the four of cups. This is you reject this, the offer. You're like, no, uh -uh, absolutely not. Because you have justice. So it's your justice not to deal with this person. Because they're also seven of swords here. This is someone that could be dealing with the justice system also. So you like rejecting this offer might be for your best interest here, Taurus. That's what I'm feeling for you. Because this person have their aha moment and stuff like that. But I feel like their damage is already done. Clarify the ace of inspiration. Yeah, four of cups. You see what I'm saying? Four of cups, four of cups. Yeah, whatever this new beginning this person want to have with you, you're going to reject it. 
Four of Cups. The Fool. See? Taking a leap of faith. A brand new, a brand new leap of faith here. You're like, no, absolutely not. We're not doing this. Uh-uh. Six of Cups. You're like, no, I'm done with the past. I'm done with garbage from the past. I don't want number, no one from the past. Whatever the past is, it's going to stay in the past. Clarify the thing of emotions. I'm with you. Yeah, seven of pentacles. Patiently, you are waiting. Why are you waiting? Oh, look at that. You're waiting for marriage. You're waiting for your ten of cups. You're waiting for your wish, your long-term stability. Clarify the ten of cups. You have the ten of cups here twice. And king of cups. So this is someone that loves you. Someone, oh my goodness. I'm still in love with you, boy. <laughs> Someone is in love with you. I don't know why this song just pop up. I'm still in love. Okay, bye. I gotta go, Taurus. Can I buy the tower for my Taurian, please? Really? How are you guys gonna do that to me? King of Wands. Oh, yes. Yes. Hello, Papi. In control, sexy, attractive, oh, handsome, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> three of cups, oh, this person, it is someone that is very entertaining, if you know what I mean, three of cups, please, clarify, <laughs> I wasn't ready. Clarify the three of cups, please, for my Torian. Clarify the three of cups. Oh, my good Jesus. Wheel of fortune. We are trying to change our ways. We are making change. But yes, daddy. Someone here like to have fun. The way they like to have three, three. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what? This is someone that's in love with you, but at the same time, they like to eat some. I'm just saying. And I put it out there, like, good Lord, I need to wash my mouth with some soap. Lord have mercy. In the Knight of Wands, in the, you know, Knight of Wands, Knight of Pentacles, this is about having not outcome, outcome. Beautiful, and then until you reach to the end, because I felt like what you is the Knight of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles, there will be a ending because the hermit is here the moon which is secrets the knight of pentacles and the five of swords yeah there's going to be an ending in the near future wow taurus huh those are the kind of people you hang around with huh well listen honey to each is on you see no judgment for me have as much fun as you want to we miss a connection. Definitely the lovers. Yes, a soulmate. You guys are in love. Yeah, well, at least they're in love with you. You might not even know. We like they're in love with you. Because I feel like you are on your own. Oh, do the work. So some of you need to do some healing works and stuff like that. Because someone is in love with you. They want the whole shebang. Oh, take a step back. Like, you're, you've been one, honey. Do the work, take a step back, you know, the universe, you know, your angels. Hey, Michael, everyone is trying to tell you, take a step back, surrender to the divine. Ay, because someone is here, like I said, someone is here, is toxic. They like to have a lot of people around. They like attention. They are attention seeker. They are like attention seeker, but they are love you. With all the 3,000 other people they are dealing with, they are in love with you. All right, my Torian, I love you guys so much. Thank you for all your subscribe, like, share, and comments. And also for all of you that are all the um, readings for me, for uh, joining my Patreon. Everything you need is in the description box below. I love you guys. Bye, Taurus.